What is good with y'all, man? It's your boy Toad. Welcome back to another vid, you guys. I hope everybody been doing well. Today, I wanted to talk about something where I don't think it has been said yet on YouTube. I don't know if anybody's made a vid like this before, but if they have, I mean, cool. But like, you know, this is my own thing. And this is what I learned to do um, that helped me with my line work. And you don't have to have a machine to do this. You don't gotta do anything to do this besides you need a pen or pencil and some graph paper, preferably. I'm gonna even show you guys how to do it with some line paper as well. But yeah, uh, make sure y'all just do me a favor though, man. Hit the subscribe button, like, and comment as well. Also, I've been doing one-on-one -on -one bid chat consultations. You guys, I know that <clears throat> mentorships are very hard to go by nowadays and i want to provide like online guidance um i've been doing this for a while to the point where i at least believe that i have a lot of valuable information that i am willing to share you know what i'm saying um and there's specific things that everybody runs into in their tattoo journey you know, stuff that you just can't find on Google, you feel me? So I want to be able to answer very specific questions, anything you guys have. I mean, you guys can see my work on IG, you know what I'm saying? See my results and uh, the results matter, you feel me? So if you guys want any sort of guidance or help like that, shoot me an email, you feel me? And uh, we will set up a one-on-one -on -one bid chat consultation where you'll get my undivided attention you know what i'm saying let's make it happen but anyways let's get right into it you guys all right you guys so there's a many ways you can do this but see i like to use a pen like this right let's make sure this is working real quick all right cool now with the lines <clears throat> i'm doing this like kind of motion here right and really you want to work on the finesse bro like it's hard in a way what i can kind of explain it like there's certain times when you're tattooing where you just really need to like finesse stuff you know what i'm saying and look at how i'm doing it bro oh see that and i'm kind of having my other hand like this in this kind of motion this is like some this is like some of the hand movements I'll make. I'll even sometimes do this kind of hand movement, right? And as you can see, I'm kind of practicing in a way where I'm going back into a line and then pulling it, pulling it, you know what I'm saying? And kind of getting used to pulling the stuff up. I feel like one thing is to, me personally, I feel like you should try to get comfortable pulling lines both ways, like down, and up, you know what I'm saying? Down and up. Just trying to get it like that, bro. Just trying to get as smooth as you can, man. Just doing this. I mean, honestly, bro, like sometimes I still be like liking to do this stuff. You know what I mean? Gotta get back to the basics. Um, <clears throat> but it sounds weird. And I know it sounds like unaffected but trust me man like these are the hand movements that you're gonna be needing to use over and over again and i don't even know why i need to explain it bro this is already pretty self-explanatory but same thing with this you know what i mean just you can take any kind of regular old notebook and you can just follow that line pulling it down going up Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. I know this vid was kind of straightforward and there's not much to it, but uh, I might make an updated version of this. Might make another vid on other tips and tricks, but love you guys.